brought my scrubs back because she was in her rotation one when, when they had the scrubs out ready for pickup so my roommate just brought back our scrubs our embroidered scrubs that we have um we have to wear these scrubs to clinic um but in sim lab we can wear any type of scrub but i am so excited So here are the scrubs. They're all the same. Um, unfortunately, there is no variety. It's just the navy blue. But let's open it up and try it on. Wait. We don't look like freshmen anymore. We look like real student doctors of Herman Ostro School of Dentistry. Super cute. Oh, don't look at the tags. <laughs> I took my tag. Mine are on. Yay! So for the top, they give you um, size options, but they don't give you any style options. So you get the same style. Um, I got one extra small and the rest small, but I kind of really like the extra small. So I'm going to see if I can maybe exchange with a classmate. Um... But the, the pants, you get two style options, and I really like the cargo. It's called Cade Cargo um, from Figs, and I really like the fit better than the, um, what is it? I think it's called the Yola Skinny Pants. Um, I thought they, the Yola Skinny Pants would be way nicer in terms of fit, but the cargo, the Cade Cargo is like, way better that's my um little sizing rant but i am really happy with it we finally don't look like d1s we blend in with the crowd and i'm happy today's a great day today's been a wonderful day hey guys so the day started out wonderful and now it's killing me i have so much to do it's beyond me the amount of work that I have to do and the amount of things that I have do is disgusting. I look like a mess. I've been literally working since, well, I had a PBL session for, since from like 1.30 to 5.15, I was sitting on my butt in the Zoom call for that long it was just the worst it killed that killed me honestly i think that ruined my day and then after that got up stretched ate something and I, now i have to go back into grind mode i mean i've been on grind mode but now i have to like go full force again but my head is killing me i didn't i had like five hours of sleep last night um not feeling the best I don't want to do this anymore. I'm dying. I don't think you guys can comprehend like the amount of stuff I have to do. Like I have a learning need for PBL due by 5 p.m. on Thursday. On Thursday, I have to work on a mock patient interview that's due the, on Friday. Um, Wednesday, I have a sim lab session, which is going to take up a bunch of time. Um, on top of that, I need to cram 15 lectures of karyology into my skull um, by next Tuesday. And um, honestly, I don't even know how to study for PBL midterm. Like, I really don't. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. Like, I really don't know. Like, I I wish I could tell you what it's about. Okay, this, this is bothering me. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to stay here. Um, I wish I could tell you what it's about, but I honestly don't even understand it myself. Um, which is why I made that video that I posted a while ago. Um, um, no? Because I don't know just what's happening. 
Okay, I'm gonna try not to cry and continue grinding. Okay, bye. patient interview so my patient and I have finished our mock interview how was it I feel interviewed <laughs> I feel questioned out <laughs> yeah. it was exhausting it was pretty weird I've been studying for probably like nine hours straight i'm losing it <sighs> okay back to studying i hope my patients appreciate all the studying that i'm doing i really hope i can please them with all this <laughs> on another note I hit 10k followers on TikTok, which is insane because I started like two weeks ago and like this doesn't make any sense to me, but thank you guys for following. Um, yeah, very, very crazy. Crazy amount of numbers. I don't understand it. Mm -hmm. 